Hey kids, it's time for another episode of Kitty Cat Gaming with your host, Mortimer! KKG! KKG! Yay! Hey everybody, and welcome back to another exciting episode of Kitty Cat Gaming. I'm here with Aaron. Hi. And uh, Aaron is from Game Grumps, and we are going to be playing Stay Stay. Stay Stay. Democratic People's Republic of Korea, my first and only trip to North Korea. Why is it... Why is it, like, horribly in, like, a makeshift Korean-looking English? Yeah, it's, like... It's terrible, yeah. I don't know. The, the font bothers me a bit. <laughs> also, it looks like it says my first anal-only trip to North <laughs> Korea. Uh, so take for that what you will. Yeah, sure. All right. What is your name? Oh, boy. Um, okay. What is your name? I guess I just type. Oh, yeah, I just type. Morty. Let's go Morty. So we usually Morty. Do. <laughs> Let's get it, because it's Rick and Morty. Yeah. <laughs> uh, it's taken a long time, but it's finally going to happen. <gasps> I'm finally on a plane from Beijing to Pong Pyongyang. 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 I'll be staying the week with a couple pen pals in the Korean army. Um, Wait, I don't think they can have pen pals. Yeah. Um, I've been writing them while on duty in Afghanistan. Ooh. They seemed interested in meeting me, so they asked me to come over on my next leave. Okay. It didn't look like it was going to happen, though. I'm not sure why, but the airport wouldn't let me fly directly to Pyongyang. Something about no direct flights, having to fly over China or Russia first. Okay. I only just barely learned Korean in time for this. Oh, thank God we learned Korean in time. Yeah, jeez. Then I had to stumble through Chinese to get there. Uh, but we're about to touch down in Pyongyang. What, what superhuman Airport. is this game about? I just learned two languages in overnight. Yeah. Oh, the pilot well, saying stuff. Well, in Afghanistan. Yeah. I think he said we're about to descend. Was he? Is this person in the you army? You say it in multiple languages too. Yeah. Uh, once we get off, I'm waiting for my bags at the claim center. I was a bit late since I had to use the bathroom, so it looks like they've already started unloading. They stopped the baggage claim carrier carriage. My bags aren't there. Oh man, this is Fubar? Fubar, fucked up beyond all repair. Oh my god, I haven't heard that one before. Uh. Don't tell me they lost my luggage. Oh, you know it. I better go find customer service before my buddies get here. Your turning, buddies? Turn, yeah, your two pen pals. Oh, right, right, right. Turning around, I walk straight into someone. Uh-oh. Crash! Oh, look, there's my it name. It was King Jong-un. <laughs> hey, why are you right behind me? I've run into what appears to be a member of the Korean military. Full suit and everything. What's more, she's hot. Damn. If you go for the chicken uniform thing. Yeah. That's you. Mr. Morty, I presume? Her English is pretty good. A bit broken, but better than most kids I met in Afghanistan. How do you know my name? We were expecting your arrival. I finally noticed that she's not alone. Another cute girl in military regalia is next to her. But how? I only told my buddies, Jiang and Yujing, that I was showing up. That would be us! Wait, I thought... It's not... I just mean, aren't Jung and Yujing well guys' names? Not always. Like some names in your country, they can be applied to both genders. The taller girl smiles politely. Ah! <laughs> oh, like Francis and Francis. I think I get it. Wait, a second? You didn't think Morty... Oh, uh, not like... Wait a second. You didn't think Morty was a girl's name, did you? Of course you're not, uh, Who would the name a girl Morty? Wow, that's race. <laughs> but you, you said it was fine if I stayed with you while I was here? Absolutely, we received special permission to have you stay in our personal barracks. Damn, personal barracks. Well, we might have a holdup. It looks like the airline lost my luggage. Uh -oh. So I need to check with service desk about that. No, no, no need to worry. We have secured your luggage. That's great. Um, where is it? It has been sent to our political bureau security checkpoint. Oh my God, You're never getting it back. Wait, look how happy she is about it. <laughs> fine, fine. Wait, what? They must make sure you have no illegal contraband on you, like anything. <laughs> really? Anything that would be a detriment to our country and glorious leader will be confiscated. Your chewing gum, gone. Your toothbrush, gone. Well, that doesn't seem to be any way to treat a friend. If you desire our friendship, then do this. Do it. <laughs> you can speak Korean, right? Well, I have been studying a little. I guess I have a handle on it. 
I'm not even- I even got this, uh, manual to help me out. I reach into my carry-on and pull out my translation guide. <gasps> Upon seeing it, Eugene slaps it out of my hand. Ow! What the hell did you do that for? You dare bring a translation manual of our mortal enemies into our wonderful country? Wow, do they really get mad at you for having... I can't be Like right. a South Korean yeah. translation manual? But it's a Korean translation manual. I'm sorry for you and G's outburst, but the manual depicts the language of the territory occupied by Western imperialists. Imperialists? I didn't think the British over ever invaded Korea. I thought it was all just one big Korea. I'm so glad you understand the situation. There's only one true Korea. Oh, good lord. Regardless, I'd like for you to work with Yoonji. She'll help you get better with Korean. And you'll help her with English. Is that what we're here for? She doesn't appear happy at that arrangement. She'll get used to it. <laughs> oh my god, that's terrible. <laughs> and you know what? Probably true to life. Yeah. I read in my old translation manual that it's polite to bow to new co-workers. I turn to Eugene and bow. Thanks for helping me with Korean. Why do you thank me? I'm honored to this help me better English. Oh my god, I hate this. It's not like I do this for you, stupid. <laughs> Either way, I appreciate it. Wow! I'm not helping you yet, though. Now you... Oh, now see. Yuji. <laughs> oh Yuji, you're so excited about our friend coming to visit. There's no need to be so rude to him. <laughs> I hope he's a good English teacher. Oh, Aaron, this is... You can't... <laughs> <laughs> it's time we went back to our barracks. You should be thankful. The top advisor of tourism recommended you stay with your guides instead of a hotel. Wow, really? You did bring a lot of foreign cash, though. As we suggested, yes. Wait, Hand it over. Why? Why? I did, though I'm not quite sure I understand why. Couldn't I just use my credit card? It would be quicker than going to exchange all of these bills for Korean won. No credit card! <laughs> Plus, I feel funny having all of these coins on me. Most of everything you need has already been paid for in advance. Damn. However, the shops you'll visit will want hard currency, and they prefer foreign bills to the won. Really? That's weird. Okay, so I'll be paying for things in my own currency then? You know, reason! Ishibo! No one! Don't own me! <laughs> <laughs> Yushin is pretty cute when she's grumpy. Her cheeks get all puffed up. I do feel a bit bad for her, though. Ugh. Um, Yuji, would you prefer I just speak Korean? Waru! What? What is she saying there? What? Waru? I think she's trying to say what? Waru! My English is no good for you! Maybe it's a bit easier for now, though. Right, now she's speaking Korean. I guess I'll have to speak Korean from here on out. Oh, we should take a picture together before we leave the airport. I get my phone out and take- Oh, that's a bad idea. You can't do that. I get my phone out and take a picture of all of us. Oh shit, they're letting him? What? what did you just do? <laughs> I took your picture, that's all. No, get rid of it! No! Oh my god. <laughs> but you look so adorable, see? Stop it! I'm not cute! Oh my god. <laughs> get it! Get rid of that photo now! I don't understand, it's just a picture. I'm sorry, but let me explain. In Korea, we do not allow photos of our military to be taken without permission, unless it's at a national event in which it cannot be helped. Damn. I must ask you to please delete that photograph. Aw, can't I keep it? It was a really good shot. Did you just give him permission. Eugene looks so adorable, being the only one so pouty. I show the photo to Jion, who giggles just a bit. He has a point. It is a pretty cute photo. Oh my god, she's so happy. Before he can say anything else, Eugene stomps over and swipes my phone. I'll save you the trouble. I guess. I guess John forgot we were supposed to confiscate this anyway. Oh my god. But that's my brand new phone. No worries, you'll get it back at the end of your stay. Oh my god, they're so cute. I will put in a call to headquarters to get you a suitable replacement. It's a brick. Yeah. <laughs> One that will work on our network. It's a I'm banana. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I saw four bars on my phone. It's best not to argue with her about this one. Uh, I guess it's not worth it. Yeah, it's very true. Please follow us to the car and we will take you to our place. Our superiors should already have finished checking your luggage. Oh, thank God. We'll be able to relax. All right, finally, we're getting out of the airport. 
Uh, they lead me to a large, boxy automobile. It looks like a 1980s Soviet car, but with some, some modifications to the interior. Mm, looks pretty nice to me. Yeah. We sit in the back, and I can't see anything outside. And I can't see into the front of the vehicle, either. It's kind of dark in here. I was hoping to see some of the city as we drove. I'm afraid that since we're taking you to our personal barracks, we can't let you see the route. What, really? It is forbidden by our illustrious leader that tourists don't know the way from the airport to military locations. I, you know, I'm wondering if a lot of this stuff is real, because, like, it's strange enough to be real. Yeah. I guess we'll find out next time on Kitty Cat Gaming. Oh, uh, shit. Next time, we're going to go to the barracks, and we're going to see where these girls stay and get comfy. So be sure to that subscribe button so you guys don't miss it. And check out Aaron on Game Grumps on the link down below. And we'll see you guys all next time. Bye, everybody. Bye.